a great idea of a market because obviously it has made a huge difference to the appearance of the town and I think in general people are appreciating it very much more. The whole town looks as if it's a much happier, better place to live in. It's a good idea because we're investing back into the community that's supported us for so long. Well this is a very good thing for the Bathgate Town Centre. Well, extra money to spend on the town centre mm -hmm. is to make an improvement for the business. The retailers here are, are looking for someone to show the, the, to match their enthusiasm and I feel as though the bids team um, sort of backs that up for us. So the more input we can have into improvements about the town shop front scheme being amongst them, then that will only help the town and the folk that come into the town to do shopping. Uh, I think because it's a business led initiative, um, it gives us the freedom and gives us a, a chance to put our, our word in to make sure that the money that is spent within the local community is spent correctly. Well, the success of it is very important to Bathgate, to lift the profile of Bathgate, to lift the positivity in Bathgate and to help existing businesses and encourage new businesses to come to Bathgate. Well, obviously, as a shopkeeper, we want more people into the town, and I think that's bound to attract more people. If, if it's a nice place to shop, people will come in and shop. People are more interested in Bathgate, and it should, it'll be successful because we'll make it successful. The aim of the bid initiative is for the public and private sector to work together. The whole idea is that the traders in, in a local oh, town vote to provide additional money for additional right, services. Right. National companies have a lot of support from their head offices, um, corporate setups and this sort of thing. When you're talking about towns like Bathgate, you're talking about a lot of small independent businesses who don't have that support. The bid gives all those businesses one local voice. Bathgate was chosen as one of the six bid areas in Scotland as it represented a traditional town centre which was in need of, of, of regeneration. For a small amount of money, and we are really talking about small amounts of money in terms of the bid levy investment, it's about making that investment, making that money work a lot harder by making a collective investment. The huge advantage of bids is it's additional to the services that the council will provide. The council does a base, baseline on the services it provides in Bathgate Town Centre and the bid money is additional to that, so, so where the council provides a set of services, bids can be used to enhance that but not to substitute it. I think it's an excellent one. First of all, it's a town centre. Um, and I think town centres have got a lot to benefit from bids. Um, it's involving a lot of the small independent businesses. It's good to see as well that the small independent businesses are actually at the forefront of taking the bid to the town centre. People like Sam Crawford and David Steen are working very hard alongside the bid team. Well, uh, I've been involved in various initiatives over this past two years, mostly through Bathgate Traders Forum, um, and I saw the bids initiative as an ideal way to take the things on to a new level. And also the bid is well supported by the council, so it really is a team effort in trying to deliver the bid into the town centre. In 2006 we were asked through the Town Centre Management Group to become involved in the application for Bathgate Town Centre to become a pilot business improvement district. When Bathgate was awarded this status, I was pleased to be elected chairman of the steering group that was set up to develop this initiative. The steering group is set up to make decisions about the development of the bid. It's a very flexible process and there's all sorts of uh, decisions to be made by the steering group, such as what the actual bid area would be, the amount of the levy that's going to be collected, and to identify projects for the, the potential bid. It's a business-led steering group. Uh, we looked for representatives from the banks, from the national multiples in the town, as well as the other retailers and, and offices. And we also looked to have a good spread geographically within the town centre of the representatives on the steering group. Well, in the initiatives that were already taking place in the town, we had a good uh, partnership with West Lothian Council. The pilot bid has helped us to strengthen that partnership and uh, I think it is very important for any potential bid to have a good link with the local authority. Well, the uh, Enterprising Bathgate uh, group have given me a presentation about the, uh, the bid process. It's uh, a very exciting uh, prospect that what has come together here has been a lot of private sector and public sector cooperation and as a result of it uh, the whole atmosphere of the town centre has been improved and I've had a fascinating walk around to hear more about what's going on to see the practical form and uh, the shape of the improvements that have been made. We organised a demonstration project for Bathgate which was the Shopfront Improvement Scheme. I think it's been identified as an excellent example of the sort of project which is possible with a business improvement 
Improvement District. It's been very successful, we've had lots of businesses involved in it and it's helped to generate a lot of expenditure in shop fronts in the town centre. The Improvement Scheme helped us to make a number of changes, the main change uh, being the shop front sign. Like we put brand new windows in the front of the shop and a complete new frontage and we're also waiting for a new sign to go above the shop. Well I've done a, a, a complete refurbishment to the business but with the help of the bid scheme, I was able to get a donation towards my painting of the outside of the shop. Well, we made uh, the front uh, all the new tiles, put the different colours and uh, also changed the sign. So because of the grant, we were able to change the whole front of our shop and we're absolutely delighted. So uh, the extra money enabled us to uh, make it as good as we possibly could. I just think the, the shop improvement schemes helped to raise the profile of the town centre with adding uniformity to some of the shop fronting. And it, the place actually looks nice, I think people will come to Bathgate to shop more. Uh, hopefully they're going to come here first before they go further afield. It's very important to identify projects which the business community see as priorities for the town centre. And in order to achieve this, we carried out a detailed survey uh, with all of the businesses and organisations within the proposed business improvement district. Bids are all about self-help, self-financing and self-management. And the big team, the big board of directors, the big company, whatever you want to call it, can do things that will help the town centre. Now that will be decided by the businesses. Among the projects that were identified as the priorities for the town centre over the five-year period were improved CCTV provision, the implementation of a car parking strategy for the town, better signage and information boards within the town centre, and the continued development of the shop front improvement scheme which has benefited so many businesses in the town centre. One of the spin-offs from the Shopfront Improvement Scheme and the Bids Initiative has been that we've been able to help not only the existing businesses in the town but also the new businesses that have come to Bathgate in 2007. In fact, the shop occupancy figures in Bathgate are better than they have been in 20 years. Back in April to kick off the Bids Initiative, Enterprise in Bathgate sponsored the 3A's Veterans Cross Country Championships in Bathgate. It was the first time the event had been staged in Scotland and it was a great success. Among the other initiatives which have been sponsored by Enterprise in Bathgate have been the skating weekend in the run-up to Christmas and this year for the first time we have the new eliminations that are spread right through the town centre um, particularly effective banner lights right down the pedestrian precinct which everyone seems to have appreciated. As a result of our consultations we have prepared a five-year budget and business plan. At the end of January 2008 Every business in Bathgate will be given a copy of the business plan, along with voting papers. This will give them the opportunity in a postal vote to decide whether Bathgate will become Scotland's first business improvement district. We need to pass two important tests from the required 25% return. Firstly, we need to achieve a numerical majority from those businesses casting their vote. And secondly, those voting in favour must represent a majority by rateable value. Bathgate needs a successful bid to build on the foundations that have been put in place over this past couple of years. And I personally look forward to Bathgate Town Centre becoming Scotland's first business improvement district. <laughs>